Hi guys, everybody knows that the vendor of SSC has changed and new style of questions are being asked in all the subjects across the examinations. So let us start analyzing the selection phase 13 question papers of graduate level examinations and let us understand what is necessary and what are the course correction measures that we can do for CGL 2025. As a part of this, let us start first talking about mathematics. Based on various inputs that have been received from all the aspirants who have given the examination, the difficulty level of mathematics has increased, but the papers are still doable, you can definitely do them, provided you do a minor course correction. The prima facie analysis says that the arithmetic questions are lengthy and there are certain questions that are being asked in new topics. For example, there are questions on probability, permutations and combinations, statistics, the questions on mean, median, mode and variance and coordinate geometry. Usually most of us don't prepare these topics for tire 1. But my strong urge and suggestion for you is that please don't ignore these topics even if they are not there in your syllabus. This is with respect to new topics and in DI there are no questions that are being asked. So at this point you are already good at DI then please don't waste your time on DI. Now with respect to the new topics that are there, there is one very good source from which you can practice. The source is the Quantum Cat book written by Service K. Verma. In this book, chapter number 19, 20 and 21 are focused on probability, permutations and combinations and coordinate geometry. But just for three chapters, you don't have to buy this book. If you have this book, then well and good. If you want a copy, the scanned copy of those three chapters, if you can tell me in the comment section of this video we will scan that and we will upload in the siddhi app as well as our telegram channel so this is about the new chapters now the overall strategy of cgl is that let us divide maths as usual into two sections and let us handle this section wise the first section is advanced math in advanced math the questions are doable all the questions are concept based and moderate usually when we are preparing for these examinations we tend to ignore advanced math because of inherent fear but this is the time when you should focus your guns on advanced math rather than arithmetic because arithmetic the questions are lengthy and calculative. Some students went on to the extent of saying that the questions are of IBPS style with respect to arithmetic. So the first step that you have to do is that improve your advanced math and advanced math is easy provided you are very good at the core concepts and the theorems. So prepare your notes, prepare the theory of advanced math, you can definitely handle it. Now the overall plan based on the new strategy, the new question style is that step number one, you brush up the new topics that is probability, permutations and combinations, statistics, mean, median, mode, variance and all those along with that practice coordinate geometry. Then you strengthen the advanced math. With respect to mock papers, based on the inputs received from various students, Earlier, we used to advocate for previous year questions mock, but today everybody knows that those marks are not relevant anymore. So what students said is that the test book advanced tests and the olive board live mocks are of a very good standard. Most of the repeaters found it beneficial with respect to these mocks. When you are writing mocks, I have one strong suggestion for you. I want you to learn a new skill. See, when the question papers are lengthy, when the question papers are being difficult, it becomes very important that we pick up the right kind of questions. In these papers, if you can pick up the right kind of questions and in the upcoming CGL, if you can pick up 15 to 18 right kind of questions and score around 36 in the paper, you will definitely do it better. So when you are writing the mocks in the next 15 days, please analyze what kind of questions am I picking. Which question should I pick up in the first round? Which questions I am not picking up in the first round? So you learn this and focus first on the new topics followed by advanced math concepts. Then you go to arithmetic. Before I conclude this video, based on the inputs written from all those aspirants who have given the graduate level examinations in the last four days, I would like to list out certain important topics. First is with respect to trigonometry. In trigonometry, 2a, 3a based formulas, secant square a minus tan square a, cosecant square a minus cot square a, those identities. And in algebra, x plus 1 by x, in these equations, the higher order questions, ax plus 1 by bx formulae, statistics then there are questions on geometry in geometry the first priority is circles circles in circles tangents tct dct 
पी ए इंटू पी बी इज ईक्वल टू पी सी इंटू पी डी आलटर्नेटिव सेगमेंट थियरम ऐंगल मेड बै अड इन अ मेजर सेगमेंट एंड मैनस सेगमेंट दीज आर द फोकस एरिया दट यू नीड टू प्रयोरीटाइज इन जियोमेट्री देन गो टू ट्राइंगल्स इन ट्राइंगल्स बी थरो ऑन सेंट्रॉइड सकम सेंटर ऑर्थो सेंटर इन सेंटर फोकस ऑन एपोलोनियस थियरम मीडियन कॉन्सेप्ट इक्वलेटरल ट्राइंगल दीज कॉन्सेप्ट देन इन मेन्सुरेशन प्लीज मेक श्योर योर मेन्सुरेशन इज गुड good quality doable questions and conceptual questions are being asked from mensuration if you have not practiced properly first you practice frustum prism pyramid parallelopiped then you practice cylinder cone especially focus on hollow because if the examiner wants to set a higher standard questions then hollow cylinder hollow sphere these are preferred then you practice coordinate geometry the questions in coordinate geometry are of basic standard focus on the y equal to mx plus c and other formulae section formulae and all this should be good once you are good at the entire advanced math then you revise arithmetic in arithmetic focus on profit and loss then installments sici questions in mixtures repeated replacement questions allegation concept of percentages and profit and loss investment models within investment models the percentage variation of partners is being changed and they are given difficult numbers in time and work there are questions on alternate work and efficiency so these are the important topics that you are expected to prepare for cgl 2025 don't get into any kind of panic mode brush up your concepts brush up the new topics first strengthen your advanced math theory then go to arithmetic you can definitely do this examination earlier in pyq marks we might be scoring 45 out of 50 but given in this scenario if you are coming up to 35 37.5 this is also a wonderful score let me tell you the cutoffs will drop down they will definitely drop down and tier 1 is only qualifying in nature the real game starts in tier 2 so focus on these changes qualify tier 1 then you will have 3 months you can definitely do well in tier 2 trust me keep practicing don't lose your strength don't feel anxious keep practicing again and again all the best